Hi, Ellen. Hello, teacher. And how are you today? I'm fine. Thank you. Good. Okay, Jialen, we're going to do some reading today. Okay. Tell me, did you did you do this test, Jialen? Test one. Look at number one. Did you do this one? Yes. You, you did. Hello, this can I borrow so my your ah. bicycle tomorrow? I need to. I need is to go to school. I left my bike at my uncle's house. Okay, let's make it a little bit bigger. John needs a bicycle for tomorrow to visit his uncle tomorrow. Peter to lend him his uncle's bicycle. What does John need? John. Needs a bicycle tomorrow. He needs a bicycle tomorrow. Good job. Yes. Okay, with that one. Okay, let's read number two. School in trains. Are we this mercy the receptionist before going into the school's, uh, school's build, buildings? If the gate is closed, please ring the bell. Okay. Um, all visitors must. All visitors, okay? Now look at number A. Visitors can open the gate without ringing the bell. Visitors need to say what they are doing at the school. Visitors must close the gate after entering the school. Uh, I think it's less to see. The teachers must close the gates after entering the school. Um, <clears throat> um, it doesn't say that they must close the gate. If, if the gate is closed, please ring the bell. So it doesn't say what they... It doesn't say they must close the gate. Uh, I think is letter B. Yes, it... visitors need to say what they are doing at the school. Good. Okay, number three. Let's read number three. I can't hear you, sweetie. You have to unmute. The news this next. Let's start again. Hi, James. No, I can't hear you. You have to unmute. Uh-uh. Hi, James. Hi, James. I'm going to see the... I'm going you know, to the... I'm going to the... To see, to see the... No, sweetie. Uh-uh. Wait. You have to read correctly. I'm going to the cinema. I'm going to the cinema with my brother this evening to see new history. Do you? Do you want to come with us? Bless me now. Can't hear you, sweetie. You have to unmute. 
I think it's letter. C. Tells Andre if you if he want to want to go with them. Yes, good job. Well done. Okay, number four. Um, let me just see quickly. Let it go double. Yeah. Lam Ann, Lam Ann, you yes. must you must go to teacher Simone. You must go to teacher Simon. Yeah. Okay, go to her. Go to teacher Simon. Okay, number four. Must for students mm, must turn off their smartphone before going into the classroom. Any any noisy phone will be taken by the teacher. Uh, I think it's letter B. Students yes. can use their phone in the classroom. Good. Okay, number five. The cooking class. Cooking class. The, the course starts. That's on Saturday. Uh, 11 a.m. and we yeah. uh, with our students of first years are welcome. Cost 15 pounds. Uh, I think is letter. A, the colors will for about a month. For four weeks, yes. Classes are, uh, the course will last for a month. Good. <coughs> Okay, I can leave number six. Let's go here. Okay, we're going to read this, okay? Three okay, teenagers was... talk about their holiday. You have to unmute. Today. Today our teacher asked us where uh where we are going on holiday and what we are taking with us. I am going to the beach with both my parents. I don't need to pass both. It will be very hot, so I am taking my taking my swimming costume and a big towel. But, but not an umbrella, I like my blue towel. It's my favorite color. My friend told me to take my camera because you can, you can sometimes see dolphins. I will also take my sweater as it's sometimes less cool at night.
Okay, next one, my teacher. Hi, teacher. I can't hear you, you're unmuting all the time. My teacher asked me about my holiday. I am going to a house in the mountains with my uncle and aunt. It will be very cool all the time, so I will take my very full scarf and glove. My aunt says there will be a lot of snow. We are going there because my uncle likes snowboarding. I am excited because I will go on a helicopter again. We are going to the top of mountain of the mountain. I must take my trainers and a wood hat. I told our teachers that I am going on holiday to the forest in Germany with my father and my brother. This will be the first time I go on an airplane. We, we will go to the airport to our before the flight. My mom says it's rain, it's rain a lot of in the areas. We are going to so I will I will take my full raincoat which has a picture of a dolphin in it and possibly an umbrella. Um, I will also take my yellow sport and boots so boots. Boots. And of course, my passports. Okay, let's go up. Good. It's so difficult if it's like this, you have to go up and down. Which person may need to take an umbrella? Who's going to take an umbrella? I think it's an three. Andrew? Yes. Okay. Uh, why, Andrew? What's the sentence? Because why did? Where does he say he's taking his umbrella? Uh, not an umbrella. Which person may need to take an umbrella? Which person needs to take an umbrella? Uh, I think it's... Uh, I think it's Ben. Yes, he says there, I'm taking my raincoat and possibly an umbrella. So he's taking an umbrella, that's Ben. Which person likes blue more than any other color? 
Which person likes blue? Uh, I think yes, then. Ben. Ben, why Ben? What does he say? Why do you say it's Ben? Uh, I will also take my yellow ball and of course my best ball. No, look at the question, Jialin. What does the question say? The question says, which person likes blue? Not yellow, blue. Which person likes blue? Uh, I think yes. Um, Andrew. Andrew, why Andrew? Because I like my full tower is my favorite school. Say again. I like my blue towel, it's my favorite color. So it's Andrew. The first one is Ben, and then it's Andrew. Okay, number nine. Which person will need warm clothes during the day? Who needs warm clothes? I think it's speech. Why? You have to read why. Because uh, this will be cool all the time. So he's taking his gloves and his scarf. So it's Peter. Okay, so let's make it Peter. Okay, which person will have to take his passport? Who's taking his passport? And tell me why. I think he is an angry because I don't need my passport. I don't need my passport. What is the question? Number nine, which person will have, uh, number 10, which person will have to take his passport? Which person must take their passport? Uh, yes, Ben, because I will also take my yellow pause and Good. of course my passport. Good, so Ben is taking it, yes. So let's mark Ben off. Ben is taking it. Okay, number 11. Which person might see some dolphins on holiday? Who will see dolphins? Who 
Who will see dolphins? I can't hear you, sweetie. I think it's bad. Why? Because uh, then uh. Why, Ben? Because Which person might see dolphins? Uh, I think is letter. Uh, on Android, you can sometimes see dolphin. Yes, good. It's Andrew number A. Okay, which person is flying for the first time? Who is flying for the first time? Is that because we will be going to the airport two hour before the flight? No, 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 no. Who's flying for the first time? It is Ben, but it's not that sentence. He says, "This will be the first time I go on the airplane." On the airplane. So it is Ben. Peter. Which person is not going on holiday with his dad? Who is not going with his dad? Is Peter. Why? Because I'm going to a house in the Mountain with my uncle and aunt. Yes. Okay. Okay, now we're going to carry on. I just want to um, put Peter in. Okay, let's read here. Uh, the for the last two years, I have been living in Palestine with my parents and my baby sister. We moved, we moved here from England, and and at first, and at first, I didn't fly is because. I miss uh, my school friend. Most students of Earthrise 
write a school in the morning. Both in hand, book in hands, and return home in the afternoon. It's a lot of homework. This is the idea we have when you think of school. However, some school like the both schools in Valadis, they are all there are little difference from what I was used to. Twice a year. Twice a year. Five years. There are rainstorms. This leaf my learn lions. Uh uh. No, let's read properly. Uh uh. Let's read again. Twice a year, there are heavy rainstorms in Bangladesh. Try again. Twice. Five years. There are heavy rainstorms in Bangladesh. Bangladesh. We call the area, area with, with lots of water that live. This, this, this live a millions, million of people. We're about clean water. Without clean water. Without clean water. Mm. Electricity and other important things. It's become dif difficult for students to go to. For children, I can't hear your words. For children. For children to go to school and and for those school to keep their door open doors open you have to read your s doors open doors open to solve this problem some people touch of a brailler idea to have the children face the bills how houses houses how health centers and school that smooth around on top of the water. Now there are almost one hundred post school each of the this school gets electricity from the sun and has and has one laptop computer in internet and even even a small library. These both schools there are there are a school and a school girls. Mm. All in one, whenever there's too much water and areas, others survey is called this type of school as still open. They pick up their students from the south, the side of the rivers and their stuff somewhere so that class 
plans begin. After the lessons, as finishes the post, schools return their students to their homes. And any another group of students is because figure out about seventies seventy thousand seventy thousand children have sister those schools in their start uh, 15 years ago. Okay, now read number 14. What does the writer say happens every six months in Bangladesh? Every six months. I think is letter I can't, I can't hear, say again. Is letter B. Yes, twice a year. It's uh, twice a year is every six months. Good. Number 15. What problem do many children have at, at different times of the year? Um. I think it's let's just see. Okay, number 16. Where can people see a doctor when there's too much water? When there's too much water. Uh, I think it's letter I. On the river, yes. Where does the writer say children can see information online? Where can the children see information online? B. 
On the side of the river? Why do you say on the side of the river? Where do you see on the side of the river? Look again. Let's have a look at the question again. The question says, just want to mark here. Uh, I think from the country. Uh, the localities. Um, the doctor on the river. Okay, where does the writer say children can see information online? Can they see them on the at the health center? It's C. It's C, it's on the boat. What is the best title for the article? Look at number A, B, or C. I think is letter. Is C. Mm, it's an unusual school. Unusual means it's not the same as always. It's not the best school. It's unusual. Okay, let's read here. Fashion change all the facing strange of the time. Keep on reading. Up until the nineteen central centuries, for example, it was quite normal. It was time normal to call. Uh, See, few. When what's number twenty? It is quite it was quite normal to feel That's number 20. Let's let see. Mm -mm. Do you fill boys in girls' clothes? What do you do with clothes? Do you fill them, dress them, or cover them? Um, You dress them, you dress boys in girls' clothes. You get dressed in clothes. Usually parents live the 